It's Wednesday, and I'm Dakota, and I'm in your face again, because it's Wednesday. Today I'm wearing this awesome hat, and I'm also wearing a shirt, weirdly. So I hope you could take me seriously, because um, we're talking about something serious today. Today, we are going to be talking about passing. If you don't know what passing is, it means being read as the gender which you identify as. Okay, I don't think I worded that correctly, but it, I think you know what I mean. For example, I identify as male. I'm walking down the street one day, and someone goes, excuse me, sir, and they're talking to me. That's passing because they gendered me as male correctly, and I identify as male. Does that make sense? We're in the same boat. We're on the same page. We're in the same boat, reading the same book, on the same page. Like the same word. Okay. Now that we're all together in this, um, I can tell you how I feel about passing. I think it's fucking bullshit. Pardon my French. Or don't pardon my French. I don't care. Um... I think passing is bullshit because I don't think you should have to look a certain way to be um, identified as your gender. Um, I don't think you should have to look stereotypically male to be read as a male. I don't think you should have to look stereotypically feminine to be read as a female. I don't think you should have to look a certain way to be read as a non-gender or every gender or a mix of some genders or whatever. I just don't think you should have to. Um, I think people should accept you as what you say you are. So if you say you're a man, you are a man. If you really feel like you were born in the wrong body, yeah, totally. I don't care what you look like. Um, that being said... I do take steps to make sure I pass because even though I hate it and I'm totally against it, I know that the world isn't like that. Like, they don't think the same way I do. I see everybody as just people, but I know everybody else sees everybody as man or woman, which is so fucking lame. I wish we could all just, you know, have been born and then people didn't care what gender you identified as and then when you grew up you were like oh I think I'm this and then everyone was like you know what that's awesome I wish people didn't automatically assume other people's genders is what I'm saying but they do which is why I do certain things to um, try to help myself pass like I'll wear a binder which flattens my chest I'll wear um, pants that don't accentuate my hips. I'll wear button-up shirts, which don't accept, accentuate my chest. Um, I do my hair a certain way, because it apparently makes my face look more um, male. Um, but I'm not gonna, I don't change, you know, how I act to pass. Like, I'm not going to just one day be like a football hero because I identify as male. First of all, not all men like football, okay? Second, that's stupid. If I want to dance in a pile of glitter, I'm going to fucking dance in a pile of glitter because that's what I want to do. And I'm going to be a manly man, and you're going to accept me as a manly man even if I am dancing in a pile of glitter. Am I saying that glitter is feminine? No. I'm saying glitter's for fucking everybody. Why are people making it a feminine thing is my question. Okay? That's what I'm saying. Please don't think that I think glitter is just for women. Because I don't think that. That's stupid. I would never think that. In addition, please don't think I hate being read as female because I don't like females or because I think it's like, it's making me seem like less of a person 
Because I don't think that. I think fucking females are awesome. I think everybody's awesome. I hate being read as female because all my life I've been told I'm a female. I've been told that you were born with this body, so that's what you are. Well, no, I'm not. I want to be read as the gender which I feel like I was supposed to be born as. I just saw my neighbor looking at me. He's really Christian. He thinks I'm the Antichrist. Anyway, um, I want to be read as male because I just feel like I was born in the wrong body. It's not anything to do with females. And it's, it has nothing to do with, you know, um, hating them or whatever. Because that's crazy. I'm the biggest feminist there is, I would say. But... Um, I know I was supposed to be born a certain way, and I wasn't, and that's the issue here, and that's why I have to go through the stupid bullshit of trying to pass. So dumb. So now that we all know what passing is and how I feel about it and um, how I pass, I'm going to give some tips on passing, even though I don't want to. Tip number one, do whatever the fuck you want at all times. Two, be comfortable with yourself. Three, if you're an FTM guy, it might help not to accentuate your chest. Four, it might also help not to accentuate your hips. Five, still do whatever the fuck you want. And maybe people will learn something, you know, from you. That's always been my way. Um, I cannot give tips on how to pass as a female or as any other gender or non-gender because I don't identify as such. And I don't want to say something if I don't know shit about it. So I'm not going to. Um, that's pretty much all I have about that. And I hope you're having an awesome week. I know I am... Warp Tour is on Friday in Camden, New Jersey. So if you see me there, please come up to me and be like, hey, I know you. And I'll be like, you do? And you'll be like, yeah, you're that guy who wears those stupid hats and no shirt. I'll be like, yes, I am. And then we'll be friends. And that'll be the start of a beautiful friendship. But for now, I am going to go watch Netflix or something and wear this hat and scare my neighbor, apparently. All right, so I'll see you next week. Later, gators.